This church is being called the mother of all churches in the whole upland Cavite. Uh, since this uh, is the oldest church, uh, was founded 1595, all churches in the whole upland Cavite were born out of Our Lady of Candelaria. Uh, actually, right now, uh, it could be considered that the retablo, the remaining retablo, the main retablo and the uh, side retablos of the church uh, is the oldest retablo being built by the Jesuits. It's really very hard to do a uh, bang, uh, thorough cleaning because we need, we need a material, we need a machine, we need something that uh, could really finish the cleaning you know, as what you have done now. Our share Philippines, we would like to express our thanks. You know? Words could not suffice to express our thanks because, uh, well, as uh, you have uh, heard, uh, you played a very, very you know, important role in cleaning the facade of the church. And uh, it's really good, huh? it's really good. Actually, it's not only good, it's very good. You know? the, the way you clean without any uh, uh, damage being done, uh, without any anything that could be changed, well, uh, thumbs up, no? thumbs up. initiatives as a company globally we're doing a lot of initiatives of course we do our business initiatives our sustainability initiative our employees uh, initiative but we also want to emphasize that we do give back to our society and one of the critical forms or activities that we do is the CSR or corporate social responsibility activities and this is one of the major activities we'll be doing this year which is involving uh, the Silang Cavite municipality we also chose this church mainly because of the. It was referred to by uh, the director of museum of San Agustin, uh, Father Ricky Villar, uh, and that was our activity, our partnership with them back in 2019 when we did the San Agustin Church. These are historical sites. These are important uh, uh, heritage sites for the country, and it's not easy to do a lot of uh, changes or a lot of cleaning activities towards these locations. No. That's why our, our team has to go through a lot of uh, approvals, a lot of coordination with different government agencies just to be able to conduct these kinds of uh, CSR activities. This really entails a lot of preparations and approvals. Prior to the event itself, we had to secure approval from the National Commission on Culture and Arts and the National Museum. Uh, why? Mainly because this is a, an important location, this important uh, heritage site, historical site, and normally that really requires this application and this approval from these commissions. And this uh, particular uh, Our Lady of Candelaria Silang Church is national cultural treasure of the Philippines. And that's why we really have to go through this approval and processes. Mm -hmm. 